Okay, so this is the 4-bit um, multiplier circuit that I designed in Logisim for lab 7. Um, over here we have the two inputs, x and y, and over here this is the output, p. Um, so basically how this works is that I used tunnels instead of just directly connecting um, all of these inputs. So if one says y0 here, and y0 here, 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 essentially that's just like a connection between from this input to all of those. Um, so I also use splitters because we have um, two, the two inputs are, our inputs are four bits. So we just use a splitter and that gives us um, the four individual bits instead of um, having, you know, having to input the, in, um, the four input bits as like separate things. We can just put them in as one thing and then split it into four from there. And the same idea when we take eight bits as the output and turn it into one eight bit output. Um, so basically how this circuit works is that every time, uh, every AND gate takes a partial product of, of the two inputs. So here we're just taking the product of Y0 and X0. So this is a partial product of these whole, the whole thing, um, the whole X times Y. So basically the way, the reason we can, we can do that is because um, if you, you take the partial products of the individual bits and then you can just add them up in the right order, um, having the right carries and everything, and that'll give you the total product. So for the first bit, um, we, we don't have to add anything together. We can just take the product of Y0 and X0 and that'll give us the P0 or the first bit of the output. Um, and one way to think of that is because um, the first bit essentially determines whether or not um, the the product uh, will be or the number will be odd or even. So if you have two, the only way to get um, an odd product is to have two odd inputs. So that's why if this, these are both and if these are both one, then taking the and of it will give you one. But if one of them is zero or if both of them are zero, this will give you zero and the, num the product will be even. Um, we see that the, uh, the circuit does actually work. Um, I can show here example was um, one test I did where I multiplied one by four and we see that we get four as we would expect. Um, also here I did uh, three by four and we can see that we do get 12 as our output, which is what we would um, expect to see.